If you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your FIFA 16 Ultimate Team coins, check the link in the description and use the code ETANI to get 5% off. What is up guys and welcome back to another player review. Today we're going to be looking at Inform Benzema who looks insane. Well actually his card looks very very balanced and he just looks suitable for everything. How does he play? Is he worth around 400 to 500k? That's what we're going to find out. Make sure you check out G2A. The link will be in the description if you're looking to buy PSN cards or Microsoft points to get ready for Team of the Year. So, Inform Benzema, I tried him out in a 4-3-3 to begin with as a lone striker alongside Messi. And I have to say, he didn't exactly fit that, uh, you know, formation too much. Then I moved him down to a 4-3-1-2 and he scored way, uh, way more goals. I think in the first game I played him in a 4-3-1-2, he scored 3 to 4 goals goals in the first match which is pretty sick in a 4-3-3 as a lone striker he was always in the middle which is great but when you play him in a 4-3-1-2 and you want to take advantage of how amazing this guy's shooting is outside the penalty area and how amazing his finesse shots because defenders with one striker they will focus on that one striker while with two strikers they don't know who they should go for because if you have if you're on the ball and you will see in the clip where a defender keeps going backwards in Instead of coming and defending against Benzema, you could easily take advantage of his finesse shot trait. And as you guys saw, a really amazing finesse shot goes into the top right corner and the goalkeeper had no chance. But that is one of the things that you're going to be taking advantage of with Benzema. He is really good when it comes down to finishing. That he, I think he's one of the most clinical finishers I have tried in this game. But there is a couple of things I did not like about him. To begin with... He felt surprisingly stiff on the ball. I don't know why. So I checked his in-game stats and it turns out he has only 76 agility. So that actually explains why. Now when it comes down to dribbling, he has I think 84 dribbling. But I feel like he had less than that. So I've tried a lot of more, a lot more players that have less dribbling but they felt more agile. Maybe it has to do with his height. He does score you headers which is pretty sick for a lone striker formation. But uh, if you're looking for a target man, this guy can be the man for you because he did score me a couple of headers which I just included one because they pretty much all look the same but I have to say um, just moving with him it just feels slow honestly I don't mean sprinting with him just moving with him he does feel stiff to change directions even when you're no touch dribbling with him it does feel pretty slow and uh, his reactions on the greatest especially his first touch it does sometimes uh, it just it's just weird sometimes so for how much money you're paying for him I did expect better in my opinion, so uh, that's what that's some of the things I actually did not like about him. Um, he's a very clinical finisher. If you're looking for someone that can finish, once you're in the penalty area, don't even change the way Benzema is facing. Just shoot. It's most likely it's going to go in. I think I scored 99% of my opportunities with him in the penalty area. He's just that good at finishing. Um, acceleration is another thing I felt was bad. Like I said, it just felt he, it took him a while to get into his top sprint speed so by then the defenders would have caught up so it really depends on what sort of striker you're looking for he does have four star skills and four star weak foot he's just a very nice balanced card with a couple of things that feel out of place and i don't know he just doesn't feel like you can abuse the mechanics with him because of the no touch dribbling problem and uh, how stiff he feels so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please hit the like button if you found it helpful and um benzuma i would say I don't really recommend him at the price he's going for there's a lot of better strikers in my opinion going for a lot less so it's really up to you and how rich you are and if you really want to try out Karim Benzema so hope you guys enjoyed it I am gonna give him a 7.5 out of 10